Hello, and welcome to this RSCAD FX tutorial video. This is video 3, providing further information on wire mode. Wire mode allows a user to easily add wires to their case by drawing them. Wire mode can be toggled on and off by using the wire mode icon in the case toolbar, or by pressing Ctrl and W on your keyboard. When wire mode is on, the cursor will appear as a pencil. Wires can be drawn single or three phase by selecting the corresponding toolbar icon. For now, we'll draw three phase wires. I can begin drawing a wire by clicking once in the draft canvas and immediately releasing the mouse button. The wire will stick to my mouse. This is not a click and drag operation. I can then determine the length and direction of the wire segment by moving my mouse to either side or up and down. Clicking once on the canvas again will end the current wire segment and immediately stick a new one to my mouse. In this way, I can make a series of single clicks to create a more complex wire path. Again, I'm not clicking and dragging. At any time, I can press the Escape key on my keyboard to delete the current segment I'm drawing, keep the previous segments, and remain in wire mode. To end a segment completely but remain in wire mode, I can double-click where I wish to end the segment. An entirely new segment can then be started elsewhere with a new single click. The Enter key on the keyboard can also be used to complete a segment and remain in wire mode. The Single Phase Toolbar button can be selected if single phase wires should be drawn. Single phase wires appear thinner than three phase wires. Though pictured as just a single line, the thicker wires represent all three phases. The breakout component, available in the Quick Access Toolbar, must therefore be used when the user wants to transition from three phase to single phase wire. Note that single phase wires are also used to connect controls components. If the user erroneously attempts to connect a three phase to single phase wire directly, an error will appear in the message area. When wires overlap, RS CADFX connects them electrically. Jumpers must therefore be used to cross wires graphically without connecting them. Jumpers can be accessed in the Quick Access toolbar on the right. The thicker jumper is for three phase wires. Hovering the cursor over it shows Jumper 3P, and it jumps all three phases together. There are separate, thinner jumpers to jump one, two, or three single phase wires. For tips on using the Quick Access Toolbar, please see video two. Alternatively, jumpers can be quickly accessed in wire mode by right-clicking the mouse. When the cursor is a pencil and wire mode is in single phase mode, right-clicking once sticks the single jumper to the cursor, right-clicking again sticks the double jumper, and right-clicking a third time sticks the triple jumper. Continuing to right-click will cycle through the available jumpers, and they can be placed in the case. When in three-phase mode, right-clicking will stick the three-phase jumper. Hitting Escape on the keyboard at any time will remove the jumper and allow the user to return to drawing wires. Taking some time to practice in wire mode will make building cases much quicker and easier in the long run for the user. This concludes the wire mode video. The next videos are on auto naming and scratch pad. The final video shows a walkthrough of building a very simple case in RSCAD FX. Thanks for watching and happy simulating.